In the previous tutorials, I briefly spoke about the autoflow function. Autoflow will take all the unused images in the picture list and place them in all the empty picture boxes throughout your book. There are certain rules the autoflow function follows and some recommendations for getting the best out of your autoflow feature. Let's begin. Decide on how many pages you would like to have in your printed book. All new projects started with the Picasso Album Maker software contain 20 single pages. Add extra pages to your layout by clicking on Page in the top toolbar and selecting Add from the context menu. Every time you click the Add button, two additional single pages will be added to your layout. Browse through the pages in your book. Replace the added page styles if need be by dragging and dropping a new page style onto the page. Remember to also add page styles in the additional pages added earlier. Every page needs to have a page style. The autoflow function will not add photos to empty pages. The autoflow algorithm will take a couple of steps to determine which page style it will use, dependent on the amount of images it has available in the picture list. Attempt to place page styles with the least amount of picture boxes in the front and the back of your book layout. All page layouts can be changed or altered after you've used the autoflow function. Click on the autoflow button here. The Picasso Album Maker software will compile your book in a few seconds. Click on a thumbnail to view a page. Or use these arrow buttons to scroll through the pages. Change the layout of a page by dragging and dropping a new page style onto the page. Use the Undo or Redo button to step through the changes made. Double click on an image to alter the crop, move the cropping frame, then click on the OK button to commit. Click here to add text to the page. Double click on the text box to customize the text. Once you are done with your book, simply click on the shopping cart to order or save your progress so you can return to it at a later date.